Hey, y'all. Welcome to the Greatness Garage. And we got another quick five here. And so we're going to talk about, you know, we've said it so many times, just do your job, right? My, my father, um, one of the things I learned from him of the things that he did that I didn't want to replicate was, you know, they should know. They should know their job. They should know what, that, what I'm thinking. What I, I expect them to do this. In my mind, I expect them to do this. If they don't do it, mm, right? Or they should know. They should be better. They know better. Unfortunately, what happens is that which isn't communicated can't be known. And there is a lot of times inferences and stuff that they've had in their past. They do know, right? And there's a time at a level of position that there's certain expectations that they should know, right? And so I'm not saying give them a carte blanche of, of just doing whatever and, and just not thinking, right? No, there's levels of expectations that are there. But one of the things that is, is going to really be difficult is if you think of something that you want someone to do, say it, speak it, write it down, put the expectations out there so they are clear, crystal clear to everyone. And it's, it's tough because it's a reflection of in your mind, when you see that they don't do it and you, God, I should have had to say it, but I, I knew I should have said, I should have said something, right? And then you self-reflect on yourself of going, you know, beating yourself up. And that increases the anger that goes with it. What we really want to do when we want somebody to do their job, we want to make sure that we want them to do the job as per the expectations I've set forth. And here's a little rule of thumb for you to use internally right? If you haven't communicated the expectation, you can't get mad. Okay. Now it doesn't mean that you don't go, okay, so here's the written expectation of what from now on, here is what we do. Now there's going to be a level at which you're saying if there's, if they say, well, okay, I shouldn't have to put the expectation out there of show up to do your job, right? Or show up on, uh, even on time, right? You need to spell that out. This is part of the expectations. But if they don't show up and they continue to break them and you set those expectations, you then have a level of, of consequences that go with the expectation. But do your job. I know what you're, you might be feeling is that they should know this, but if we don't communicate this, um, it's on us. It really is. If you really want the future, you can be right or you can be better. You got to choose which one you want. The one saying that really hit, and, and I speak this from my experience, right? Because I did, I had these expectations. They should know, they should, right? And it's part of where the with them, uh, group, what's in it for me, uh, thought process comes from as well. One um, little, you know, kind of jokey thing, but that really sticks for me is this, is there was a picture one time of a child and it says, if you have to tell a child the same thing for the thousandth time, it's not them who doesn't get it. You know, and that always sat with me that's going, yeah, it's because the way that I keep saying it in the same way and they don't hear it, well, then why are you saying it in the same way? You know, I'm blessed right now to have two young daughters and one that's two and a half that, oh my, tests everything. And she's, she's just like I was. And it's funny, I realized that if I say it this way and she's kind of coming at it, right, we're coming head to head, I've got to step to the side. I've got to present this in another way. I got to create a different environment around it because I know what I eventually want is I want her to understand what she's doing, why she's doing. I want her to, to be able to do whatever this is. Um, I don't want the fight. So if I don't want the fight, keep going at it in the same way is not, is, is not going to provide the results that I'm looking for. So the next time when you're looking and you get this position where somebody would wish, when you wish somebody would just do your, their job, remember, Right. Have I completely um, set all the, ex the detailed expectations for this? And if not, don't get mad at yourself. Don't get mad at them. Just set the expectation. Explain to them the consequences of not meeting that expectation and then enforce it from there on out and hold them accountable. And that's going to be the best way to get the results that you're looking for out of this delicate situation. Have a great one. Make it a great week. Make it a great life. We'll see you soon. Bye bye. Remember, action is what makes this information all worth it. If you need help figuring out what that action is, go to callwithbrad.com and we'll get some clarity and help you figure out what that should be.